Once again, the governor of a southern state said, no Negro shall be admitted to an otherwise white enrollment. And with the entire world as witness, judge, and jury, Tuscaloosa and history met on June the 11th, when two American Negroes expressed their desire to enroll at the University of Alabama. It was, in effect, a single defiant man holding with strength to the weak mores of the past against the Constitution, the government, and the will of the people of the United States, both Negro and white. With the protection of federal marshals, Vivian Malone and James Hood entered the University of Alabama in Tuscaloosa. There was no violence. The governor conceded. <laughs> 